guys, it's me, Elizabeth Lauren, and welcome to my channel. So today I have another eyeshadow video for my series, and yeah, I came up with this really fun yellow sunshine inspired look because I've been loving yellow lately, and it's really been trending, so yeah, I just wanted to show y'all a really quick and easy look that you can do with only like two colors, so if you'd like to see how to get this look, then just keep watching. Okay, so for this look, I'm going to be using the Urban Decay Full Spectrum Palette. And I'm going to open it up and show you the colors we're going to be using. So, the main two colors that I'm going to be using are Calavera, which is this really pretty canary yellow color, and Goldmine, which is this yellowy sparkly color. So hopefully you can see that. Okay. So, as always, I'm using my Morphe brushes, and yeah. Okay, I'm going to start with this flat brush. See, it's pretty flat. And I'm going to take that Calavera color and pack it on my lid. This look is really, really easy. And so pretty to do, especially for like the spring and summer. This eyeshadow is pretty pigmented, it's just you have to keep dipping back into the pan because not all of the color comes off of the brush the way you want it to. Hopefully you can see that because the lighting is a little weird today. Okay, then just do the same thing to the other side. So now I'm going to be taking my crease brush, really fluffy crease brush, and I'm going to take that same Calavera color and put it all in my crease. The reason I decided to do a yellow is because it's such a trending color right now. And it's just so pretty. I don't know, I just really like it. Like, when I first did this look, I showed it on my Snapchat. And I was like, wow, I really like it. So, I decided to recreate this look for you too. And then just shape it the way you want it in the crease. You can make the yellow go really out or you can just have it like subtle. It's up to you. Okay, now I'm gonna take that gold mine color, the same flat brush that I've been using, and I'm going to put this on the middle of my lid to kind of give it like a little bit of dimension. gonna just take my finger too because with these shadows it just works way better but yeah I'm only putting this in the center of my lid and just tapping it so it looks like that Now I'm going to take my smaller, dense Morphe brush and I'm going to take that gold mine color again and put it in the inner corner. Okay, it should look like that. Okay, so now I'm going to take my Becca Cosmetics Highlight in Moonstone. Yeah, Moonstone. And I'm going to go over my inner corner color with some of this. And I'm also going to take that exact same Moonstone color and put it as my brow highlight. 
And now to make this look complete, I want to add a little bit of mascara. And I'm using the Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara. Okay, so now to add a little bit of color to my face, I'm going in first with my little um, sample of the Tarte's blush in the shade Party. So yeah, and I'm going to be taking a big Morphe brush and just, you know, putting some blush on. I really like this blush because it's natural and it just looks so pretty on my skin tone. So yeah. And you can really like build up the color up if you want or just, you know, do it subtle. Okay, now I'm going to be taking the new Maybelline Master Chrome Metallic Highlighter in 100 Molten Gold. Oh my gosh, I'm in love with this highlight. I literally just got it yesterday and it's so pretty, it's so pretty. So I'm going to be taking a Real Techniques blush brush, I said blush brush, oh my god, brush and I'm going to be highlighting to the gods. Do you see that already? I don't know if y'all can see this but like my nose is already glowing and I barely am putting product on. Okay, so I closed my blinds. I'm sorry guys if y'all couldn't see, but look at my nose. I look like Rudolph. Yay! I'm actually gonna tap a little bit more onto my nose because for some reason you can't really tell. But there it is, okay. How to highlight my face. y'all can see that but I'm in love y'all need this like it's so it's so pretty I'm going to stock up on it like I'm not even joking literally gonna go back to Walmart and buy some more okay so now to finish this look I like to do a lip color now you can do any lip color you want like for example you could do a really pretty pink color like Kat Von D's Ophelia you could do a really beautiful golden gloss from ColourPop in my jam, but today I'm going to use the Kat Von D shade Bow and Arrow. This is a really pretty light brown, and I just think it'll look really pretty with this look. Oh my god, this lighting! Okay, so I'm going to be taking the Kat Von D liquid lipstick in Bow and Arrow, and yeah. thank you all so 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 much for watching um if you liked this video then please give it a big thumbs up and thank you all for everything that y'all do for subscribing to me for liking my videos commenting it really honestly means the whole entire world to me so i just wanted to say thank you and i will see y'all in my next video bye loves